can't stop talking about this week's crossover episode with private practice, but probably not as fast as Sada Ramirez does in the sneak peek. Take a look. You are here because you and your little pals are all freaked out about the oral boards, and Dr. Weber suggested that Callie Torres might have a special secret study method, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, Dr. Weber's correct. Callie Torres does have a study method, an excellent study method, but she's not about to just give it away. Callie Torres' study method has to be earned. Frankly, she doesn't think that Meredith Grey has what it takes. I think she does. I think Meredith Grey has what it takes. This VP was low and his vessels are collapsed. Could only get one good IV in. We're gonna have to get another one. For her sake, Meredith Grey better hope she's right. Because today, today's gonna be a grind. Woohoo! Please welcome Sada Remitted! Come here, you look fierce and fabulous, Thank Mama. You. So you know, we were we were talking it was something a little somber. We were at the <laughs> table. Pull it down a little bit. Sorry. Yeah. Now somebody <laughs> waved. That's why I pulled it down. I just keep doing this. Okay. It, it, the thing, it looks beautiful. Um, we were at the table. And we were talking about you know uh, the influence that Whitney Houston had on all yeah. of us. And and uh, did you want to share she, something? She, oh, she influenced absolutely. You? I grew up listening to her. Yeah, throughout my childhood and growing up in high school for sure. Um, I will always love you. You know, the greatest love of all was one of my favorites of hers. And um, I actually would listen to her all the time and, you know, try to sound like her or whatever. You know, it was just like she was so influential to me, her style, her grace, uh, her voice. I mean, I, she will be missed. So. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. She will. It's a tragedy. Yeah, it really is. So now we're going to go on to Grey's Anatomy. Okay, you are Dr. Callie Torres, and you have gone through the ringer, your journey. I mean, just in the past few years, you, you, you have been in a near-fatal car crash. Your baby almost didn't survive. Now, it, it was really great. You slowed down a little bit because you and your wife, Arizona, you, you kind of stayed out of the fray. You're in a lesbian relationship. Yes. Yes, okay. We're There's a lot of Callie. I'm not. Callie. Callie. No, no, no. no, 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 no you're not. Your character, Callie. You had more birthday sex than any other... Uh, yeah. You had a lot of lesbian sex on that show. Yes. A lot. Yes. Yeah. So, I, I, I guess... You must, have, like, wait, you must have a big male audience. <laughs> <laughs> they love it. So then I guess my question is, are we going to see a lot more of this? You, you staying out of the drama or a lot more lesbian sex? <laughs> what are we going to see more of? Uh, probably the lesbian sex. <laughs> uh, no, I think they're just... They're keeping it light this year. We were so heavy last year. Um, yeah. And uh, so I think they're just sort of focusing on other characters, other characters' relationships, like well, Christina. Lesbian sex is such a light subject. Well, and yeah. uh, Owen. <laughs> Speaking of crossing over, there is a, a episode, crossover episode with private practice that's yes. coming up. Tell us about that. Well, how, is, uh, how is it happening? Uh, yes, Amelia what? Shepard, Derek's sister, is going to be coming over to mm. enlist Derek to help her save a life. Okay. And uh, we, Christina Noen, enter um, couples therapy. So that's going to be really interesting. Yeah. Oh, okay. um, and uh, yeah, the oral boards are coming up for the residents. And so um, Meredith and Callie work together on a case that involves a meat grinder. Oh. And yes, oh. wait for it. Oh, yes, God. it's I'm pretty not, gruesome. Another light subject. <laughs> I know. Right? Yeah. I personally really, I, I love walking in and seeing all that stuff. I mean, the 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 real stuff. I'm I'm sure is is takes you back. But the on Grey's Anatomy, you know, we know it's fake, but they make it look so real. Right. And yeah. I just yeah. personally am fascinated I've by away it. a couple of times. <laughs> I, mean, yeah. I, have, I have. Last week, either maybe last week or the week before, there was another episode where it was a what if episode. Yes. Which I thought was really beautifully done. Again, crossing over with lots of different Yeah, Kate Walsh came ideas. back yeah. and um, we were all paired up with different people. Well, some of us were paired up with different people. Right. Um, yeah. Callie was with Owen with children and got to do, you know, I mean, the, the actors, we have fun when we when we get to do different hair and makeup and clothes and just in a, in a sense you're almost playing I'm a different sorry. character in I'm a sorry. way. Can I see your finger? Yes. I'm sorry, did you? What is this? <laughs> yes. You just got engaged, huh? <laughs> Beautiful. Around like 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 this. <laughs> you're just you're supposed to do it. Yeah. Yeah. I, I want to get back to what you talked about. Congratulations. When are you getting Thank married? Thank you. Thank you. I don't know yet, but we are very in love and very happy, oh, happier yes. than we've ever been. So. Nice. Thank you. you want to yeah. tell us about him? Okay. It's wonderful. We all we all our privacy. Thank you. But uh, it's not very private on the show because you play a bisexual character. We talked about you conceived a baby with Dr. Mark Sloan. You're raising the baby with Mark and your on-camera wife Arizona. 
uh, what I wonder, do you think this storyline has helped to broaden people's ideas of what a family is? I hope so. I, I don't know, but I hope so. I hope at least it starts a civic dialogue about how people feel and um, just the value in acknowledging and respecting a family that's not necessarily blood related and that consists of more than one parent. I think that's very common these days, actually. But that doesn't so. just reflect what you think should be right. You know, people have choices in this world. Yeah, absolutely. Right. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. And uh, I was excited to be a part of that storyline and to continue to show that, that a group of people can be adult, rise above a potentially very emotionally difficult situation and really focus on the child. I think sometimes people forget that the children really matter the most in a lot of these situations. I and love so, that your character's name is Callie and your wife's name is Arizona oh. and they call you Calzona. <laughs> yeah, they do. <laughs> <laughs> they do. Oh, right. Yeah, it's like a rolled up kind of pizza, right? It's like a, yeah, we're delicious. There's it's like an apple turtle. We're delicious. It's Before we go. But with cheese in it. Okay. <laughs> it's almost lunchtime, okay? We have, <laughs> there's, uh, there's also another project that you're really excited about and I know that you're actually playing, there's a part in the um, new Disney animated film called yes. Sophia the first. Yes. Can you tell us first. about it? Yeah, Are you the mom's be... voice? Yes, I'm playing Miranda, uh, mm -hmm. her mother. And Erla Winter uh, plays Sophia. And uh, it's a story about a little girl and her single mother who meets the king um, of the village and marries the king. And so they move in with the king and his two kids. And so it's a blended family story. But really, it's about Sophia learning how to become a princess and that that although you can have all the material things in the world, that what really matters is what's in your heart and being a kind, compassionate person. And, so. and also, congratulations on that. I heard you're doing a benefit concert with the rest of the cast. Yes, Grey's Anatomy. Anatomy. We're going to be doing a benefit concert on March 18th for the Actors Fund. Nice. Go to www.actorsfund.org to get more information, but it's on March 18th. And uh, we're really excited. We're going to be doing some songs from the musical episode, yeah. and we're going to be doing some songs that have been played on Grey's Anatomy from the soundtrack. Oh, you guys. So great. it's going to be live. Music. There's going to be a live band. It's going to be really exciting. UCLA, so please buy your tickets and come out and join Sada, us. I like how you flash the left engagement ring finger all the time, <laughs> not the right. We want to thank Sada Ramirez. Oh Grey's Anatomy airs Thursday night.